So the first godly habit is reading our Bible every day. Amen, right? But not just reading it to tick off a box on our Bible reading plan or a devotional, but to really ask the Holy Spirit to sit with us in this moment and to reveal, to speak to us, to let the rhema word of God, the spoken word of God, oh, enlighten us about what the Logos is trying to say. I have a, um, a little couch in my office where I do my devotion in the morning, and it's a little two-seater love seat. And the seat right next to me is Holy Spirit's seat. And I welcome the Holy Spirit every morning. I don't even put my phone or a pen down because that's his seat. And I told first service if my cat wants to sit there and if he doesn't want to boot her off, that's fine. He can have a cat sitting on his lap. But I respect the fact that the Holy Spirit is there and it has completely changed the dynamic of my Bible study where I understand and I expect Holy Spirit is here as my teacher and my counselor. It's not just a duty. 